Hi everyone, welcome to Linda's Thrifty Life. I am so happy to see you today. I hope everyone is doing well. I'm a mess, but I have been crafting away. So this is a project share for BB Crafts um, slash Globeland, who reached out to me um, and offered me some products in exchange for um, a few videos, in my honest opinion. And I've already done the unboxing, and this is my first project share. So one of the things I got was a bunch, well, it was like one um, packet, and it had, I think, seven um, sheets of of uh, acrylic stamps in it. And I was like, wow. And this is one, two, with all the cactus. This is strawberries, three. Now I didn't use any of those in this project, but I used a little bit from all the others. So <clears throat> this one is the sunflower stamp. And I decided that I was going to stamp them on some um, tags and watercolor them. How fun. So this is two that I made. This is the very first one I made. And I colored the background. Then I added a little um, sentiment stamp that says, For You From Me. And then this one I left white. I left all the rest of them white. I kind of liked it like that. And this one I says, let love grow. So I stamped them and then I watercolored them and I had such a good time. These were the perfect little stamps for that. The next one I have is the rose and all different rows. And I used this stamp to stamp out some roses. So this one is a pink rose and I added Thinking of You, which came from another one of these stamps. I kind of wanted it at the top, but it didn't fit correctly. So if I was doing this one again, I would raise the rose up higher and have more room for the sentiment down there. But that's how you learn. But I still, it's, it's not going to waste. And then this is the other rose that I made and I put love you on there. I had such a good time doing these. I stamped them out using an ink that wouldn't run with a watercolor. And then I um, let them dry and then use my watercolors. So this is a, a mushroom stamp. I love mushrooms. I wasn't sure how this would come out, but you tell me, I think it's cute. So, this is the one I did, and it says, Let Love Grow. I thought that was fun. And then this one I did with these, um, the watercolors are, um, uh, what do you call them? Metallic. And I think this one came out really pretty. And I like it for you from me. Isn't that cute? Now that one I really, I like the way it came out. I wasn't really sure. May, not, may or may not be how mushrooms look, but... <laughs> I like it. And then this is the one that has some flowers on it and some little sentiments. It says, sending love on your birthday, let love grow, thinking of you. And if friends were flowers, I'd pick you. So I made this one. Now I, this was operator error. I didn't get a really good stamp, but I went ahead. I didn't want to waste it, so I went ahead and colored it in and added the sentiment, and I think it just looks really cute. That'd be really um, cute to put on a little package. So, that was my um, uh, projects that I made using these stamps, and I just see so many more projects using these. I will leave the link below to the product I chose, and um, I hope that all of you will go and check it out, and I will see you soon. I have one more great project share to um, bring you. Bye now.